All right, what's going on, guys? It's Reset. So we're going to be going through and having a look at everything that is available this week in Destiny. It's the second to last week, so if we go to the season, 13 days left till season 22. Pretty cool, pretty cool. So there won't be any more seasonal challenges available. I still need to actually just grind my way through those because uh, I need bright dust. But we're going to start in the store this week because we have a new shader. We have Ego Maligan. That actually looks, that actually looks quite nice, to be fair. That's really, like, really popping blue. That looks cool. I like that. Let's grab that. Next up, we have the Neopop Wave. Very bright. Then we have the Unspun Fate. Then we're going on to Prototype Submersible. Um, <laughs> that actually looks like the, the Titan that imploded. Lol. <laughs> Rip. Uh, we've got Catch of the Day emote. Big old fish. Yay. Moving on to the Bright Dust store. By the way, if you're enjoying these and you find these useful, make sure you hit that subscribe button and drop a like. really helps out the channel. And I really appreciate it. Alright, the first uh, thingy emote is the Kitty Pool. It's a multiplayer emote. You can just chill. Then we have the... Ooh... Ooh. Got these for the point cannon brace. I'm actually grabbing those. I'm really enjoying using that exotic. So we're going to grab those. We have the controversial. Convertible. Oh, the oh, Jesus. Convertible. I'm tired. <laughs> Brain is not functioning as it should. <laughs> uh, we have the convertible shell. Then moving on, we have the Bright Nostalgia. Why are the buttons and dials so big? No, no, but oh, yeah, there's actually some. That's pretty cool. Uh, we have the Star Race Night 5. I like the trail. That looks pretty cool. Then we have... We have the Winterbite Glaive Weapon Ornament. That's pretty sick. I don't know whether I'll pick that up or not, though, to be honest, but I do want to pick it up. I'm saving my Bright Dust for next week, as it's the last week, so I want to make sure I have, uh, don't miss out on anything. But the spicy ramen projection. We have the champion entrance. Amazing. Look at this. Boom. That entrance is so good, you can't even see it. We've seen that one a million times. We have the Dark Blade effects transmat. We don't. We're going to have this one. Alright, they're, they're all the same, these, apparently. Oh, there we go. That one worked. Get me back on it. Boom. Fireworks. Are these ones going to work now? Yay. Sweet. And then we have the champion entrance. Nice. Then we have... I'm not even going to try and pronounce words. Brain isn't looking today. We've got a nice orange and black shader right there. Then we have a another one. Green. The green shader. I've got the war brick shader. I really like this shader. It looks nice on weapons. It looks really clean. I've got a nice black and purple shader to finish off the brightness store this week. Let's move on to what weapon is in the Grandmaster this week. This is the Braytech Offspray. I haven't actually. I've not really done much this season, to be honest with you. I've not really done many Grandmasters. I normally do all of them. But I've never, never bothered this this season. To be honest with you, uh, we'll move. You know what? We'll do. We'll do what's uh, on the destinations last. So weapons this week. Banshee has Lovrock C with Osmosis Cascade Point. We've got a compulsive reload adaptive munitions. Outlaw demolitionist. Fan cartridge. Snapshot sights. We have perfect float and opening shot. And then we have legal action with heating up rampage. We've got another Lobrock with Perpetual Motion Target Lock, Subsistence Frenzy, Zen Moment Moving Target, Impulse Amplifier Explosive Light, Snapshot Sights and Danger Zone. And we'll uh, zip over to 801 real quick and then we'll go to the destinations. And see what uh, pinnacles we have for people that still need it, slash what we can grind for this week. As there's not much left to do in this season with... You know, the season window closed, there's not really much left. 
Hello, Doggo. So, we'll see what we can grind for if there's any masterwork. Not masterwork. Artifact armor that we can grind for this week. So, we have Midnight Shader. That orb is black and yellow, which is quite nice. And on the armor, it is all black. And we have the Mad Monk. It's like a, like a carbon fiber sort of looking look to it. Then we have the War Cult Endgame. I don't actually have this shader. Nice white and blue shader. We're going to grab that. It's only 10k glimmer. See you next time. Pick that up. Perhaps. Move away from Ada One because she's loud as. So let's go on to the destinations. We have Vanguard. Don't forget we have the uh, rocket launcher. We have Psyops Moon. It's the, uh, the Nightfall this week. Grandmaster. Arc Soul and Void Shields. Barrier and Unstoppables, you have an increase to Arc Damage. We have Extinguish, Limited Revives, Fire Pits, Chaff, Overcharge Weapons, Arc Surge, Void Surge, and Overcharge Machine Guns. If you want to get your Exotic, you want Arc Threat, Strand Surge, and Solar. So just throw on Solar, Strand, or Arc. Run your Strikes till the progress bar is complete, and you'll get yourself an Exotic. Moving on to Gambit. Just play three games, you get an exotic. Moving on to Crucible. Crucible Labs, we have Countdown Rush, Team Scorch, Comp, bit of your uh, chance at the Sniper. We've got Rumble, Control, and Supremacy. Moving to the Legends tab, we have King's Falls Raid as the weekly rotating raid. And we also have the Grasp of Avarice that we can grind Artifice Armor in. So you're going to have all the shields. Uh, maximum effective level is 1820, but it's 1840. You've got barrier and overload champions. You don't need to, you don't need to lock loadouts, so you can just run whatever and swap to it when you need it. Take it out and then swap back to your loadout if you want to. Overcharge weapons, arc surge, void surge, and overcharge rocket launcher. So throwing on a galley with some hotheads is going to do big damage. So... Just don't shoot each other in the back. <laughs> uh, Lost Sector. We have it on the moon. We got K1 Revelation. Barrier and Unstoppable. Void Threat. Arc Shields and Modifiers Fire Pit. I believe that is everything. Raid, Dungeon. That's it. So, yeah. That's going to do it for this uh, reset. you got 13 days. I've got quite a lot of challenges to... Uh, to go through. So, yeah. <laughs> I'm going to try and get through quite a few of them because I do need Bright Dust. As you can see, it is quite low. But, uh, yeah, we're not far away from the new season. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you drop a like, subscribe, all the good stuff. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye for now.